when I got scammed, story time. So believe it or not, I got scammed before. As I always say to everyone, you don't really know something until you know something and you really don't know something often until you've experienced it for yourself. So for those of you who know me, some of you might be wondering, well, how did you get scammed, Papa Hector? Like, how is it possible you grew up in spirituality, in a spiritual household, etc.? Well, someone can be standing on an, under an umbrella, never having felt the rain, but think they know what the rain is like. As they say, you don't know the value of an umbrella until it rains. So, it was actually because I grew up in a spiritual household, probably, that I fell for it a bit. See, I had never really been around scammers. I had been, I had seen people who had come to my grandmother, my godmother, and my aunts who had been scammed. I had heard stories. I had worked with clients who had been scammed. I had heard stories, etc., etc. And naturally, I thought that I would recognize it when I saw it. As far as everyone I worked with spiritually in training and developing up until this point, many of them were relatives or family related, so I was never really worried about being scammed and it wasn't something I had to watch out for. So as a result, I had known about them, I had heard about scammers, I had heard stories, seen cases, etc., but it had never happened to me. So there was a point in my life where some of my mentors, my elders have passed away, but I still needed to go to Haiti to go ahead and go further because that's what the Lua was asking me to do. They wanted me to go there and do certain things. So I went and I found a Mambo and the Mambo was really, really popular at the time. And there were certain signs I probably should have seen, but I didn't. So I had a consultation by the Mambo. The consultation was decent. And, you know, I decided to go get initiated by the Mambo. Being kind of really naive about the whole situation. Mind you, I was just 18 years old. So, even at 18 years old, I gathered all my funds, saved my dough like I had done many times before for other initiations so that I could go to Haiti and receive this initiation. And it was the beginning of a shit show. Like, comment, follow for more, follow for part two, leave comments in and topic suggestions in your comments, really appreciate them. Blessings.